Hey everyone, this is a crowd work show. All the comedians are not gonna do any of their material because I've seen it all and I'm like, you're gonna wanna. <laughs> not, not on my show. <laughs> but this would be funny if a comedian talks to you, you just talk back. You're shaking your head no, and you're in the second row. You're gonna wanna move. <laughs> you're in what the French call the worst spot. <laughs> Let me talk to you about how hard dating is. Um, see, that's how they normally are, and this one is different. No more people, don't let any more people in. Do we have that board that we use to jam the door? <laughs> The fire code door, <laughs> yeah. Let's make it difficult for all the firefighters to get in here. Let's fire, fire person proof this, this place. Okay, great, how are you, man? You're, I'm okay, no one ever asked me. That was nice. We're off to a pretty good start. What did you do today? I took a bus for two hours to get here. To get here? Wow. Too much pressure? <laughs> Instantly too much pressure. Give me one second. There's somebody who took a bus for two hours to be here, so we gotta be decent. Mia, you listening? You gotta try hard tonight. Not like last month. Will, two, two hours somebody. You know how expensive a two hour bus ride is? How much was your bus ticket to get here? About, about two bucks fifty. Two bucks? You took a, hold on, they let you stay on a thing in anywhere for two hours? For two dollars and fifty cents? That's crazy. That's the cheapest thing ever. I took an Uber for 15 minutes, it cost me fifty dollars. Okay, thank you for, where'd you travel from? From Altadena. Altadena? That's a, in a movie. <laughs> and this is how it'll go for the rest of the night. How's everybody doing? You guys have a good day? Did you have a good day? Yeah. Nice. Yeah. That's great. I wasn't expecting you to be so cheery. I don't know why. You look like a nice enough person. What, you don't have a cheery face? You have like sad puppy dog face. Turn around and show everybody your face. <laughs> right, like you just lost an art contest or something like that? Good. What did you do today? What's your name? Colby. Colby, of course it is. Mike? Good. Kobe. Uh, Colby, right? Because of the basketball. You familiar? <laughs> the cheese. Colby cheese. Colby! Good. I'm killing it so far. What did, uh, what did you get into today? Oh boy, start after. <laughs> you tried on taxes. Toxins. That makes more sense. <laughs> tried to do taxes, never done them before. Figured I'd get an early jump in August so they don't sneak up on me. There's a bunch of IRS agents sitting right behind you. So as soon as we're done, See ya. <laughs> Dude just puts handcuffs on you. Enjoy, enjoy the rest of the show. <laughs> Relax for the rest of the show. What about you, man? What are you up to? Well, I know what you're up to. That was a bad... I can see what you're up to right now. I'm fucking up. What did you do earlier, earlier to, when we weren't together? <laughs> Oh shit, you said, okay, so your mom, just to get everyone on the same page, you covered for your 18 year old sister, who is old enough to smoke weed if she wants to. No, right, 21? She's 17, forgot how old your sister was. So you went from being a really good brother to kind of a dismissive brother in the same conversation. So your mom found two of your sister's joints in Doing what? Was she tidying up? No, yeah, we were, um, she's moving out of her apartment in November, so we were clearing out one of the bedrooms. Yeah. And she was 
the weed den. <laughs> the, oh, your sister's opium den. Yeah. She just like my sister hid them in like a Russian nesting doll. Oh no, that's the first place moms look. How do you think my mom found out that I lost my virginity? I hid it in the. I'll get to the bottom of this. maximum amount of Russian nesting dolls that you could have before you get arrested. So wow. your <laughs> so your mom found joints and then she was like, Rebecca? Or what, what's your sister's name? Uh, well, my sister wasn't home, but her name is Camille. Well, she still has a fucking name. <laughs> <laughs> oh, as soon as you get home, I'm gonna remember your name. And then you're gonna get yelled at so tough. Okay, so your sister's name is Camille. Yeah. That's a cool name for somebody who's not 90 to have. It's about time we made some new Camilles. And then uh, your mom found joints and your mom is not a weed person. Not really, no. No, not really. She was like, I'm disappointed that you're involved in the weed. Involved in drugs. You're all caught up with the Russians. <laughs> You're colluding with the Russians to hide drugs. <laughs> Are we filming? Do you guys have plenty of room on the card? Because I'm doing great. <laughs> cut that part out. Cut the, cut the part where I wasn't being humble out. So you're going to your friend's wedding. You're in the wedding party. You're the best man. Do you want to practice your best man speech? Do you know what you're Do you know what you're Don't laugh like it's a goddamn comedy show. Have some respect. It's a wedding for a second. Uh, tell me a little bit about your friend. Let's write your speech. Let's see. I met him in high school. Uh-huh. Yeah, yeah. I met you in high school. Yeah. You, can start, you can start doing something like that. Before I make a joke that his parents thought it would probably be me up there on the His, hold on. Oh, his parents thought we would. Oh, really? <laughs> Wait a minute, is this a thing where you're like... in your friend's relationship. Are you really best friends? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, I don't think my parents have ever thought that I was fucking any of my friends. <laughs> what were we talking about? So you... Uh, you're the best man, you meet your friend in high school, and then you've been inseparable ever since. You grew up out here, or what? Oh, uh, yeah. Yeah, I was born in Washington, but I was moved out here since I was 10, so... Okay. You skipped oh, wow. most of it. <laughs> well, what did you do in high, what were you like in high school? Did you play sports in high school? No, you did drama in high school. They played video no. games and played weed. You played, so you and your friend. <laughs> I was just saying, that's part of the friendship. You didn't smoke weed with anyone until college? Yeah. Great. <laughs> no, 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 that's okay. The, the hanging out, Indoors and playing video games is way more lame than not smoking weed and talking. Uh, so that's why your parents thought that you were having sex because you were just locked in your room. <laughs> yeah, nice. Always hanging out and being near each other and kissing. My <laughs> parents didn't like how me and Jeff were always open mouth kissing. They thought we were gay. <laughs> Jeff has the softest lips. Don't make me out to sound gay. I just say Jeff has soft lips. <laughs> Where are the people from New Zealand? New Zealand? Very <laughs> far? Very easy? Not done, I'm just kind of warming up in, into it. <laughs> You're so far away from home, I figure if one of us covers your native language, it'll be more comfortable. Is everyone just speaking the Queen's English? It's about to win. Let's, get, let's inject a little kiwi into it. It's... Right? <laughs> Scrambled in other otherwise? Other say otherwise? Otherwise. Otherwise. <laughs> <laughs> well, you're a good person. You're a good does your sister know that you stuck up for her? Yeah. Did you text her instantly? <laughs> hey, guess how much you owe me right now? You owe me about two joints, baby girl. <laughs> Oh, that 
that's horse shit. Your mom is so high right now. Your mom's about twice as high as you are right now. <laughs> that's, and I send you to college and your sister and I'll, you think about, you think about that. Are you guys, where do you guys live in, in town? We live in New Zealand. You live in New Zealand? <laughs> See how I, just real quick. <laughs> so you're just here on, on holiday? Or, uh, yeah. Being of a holiday, being taken up by all this. Did the plans fell through and now we say here? Here. 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 Good. Are you on vacation? Yeah. Nice. From <laughs> What is what is regular what's your regular life like? Yeah, it's way different than a bank right now. <laughs> you used to be as far as away from a bank as you can possibly be. This is way different than being at a bank. Good. What if I just gave you a bunch of money right now? I was like, hold this real quick. <laughs> no, no, thanks. I'm on holiday. That makes me. <laughs> Any other day, I say, yeah, I'll take that. Organize it. So on and so forth. Is he gay? No. He's not. He's marrying your friend. Is that how you know each other? Yeah. Okay. Did you, are you like together for the, with the wedding? Are you walking into the reception together? Are you doing this? He's the best man, I'm just a bride. Just a bride. There's no such thing as just a bride. You're all so important. <laughs> Good. How do you know um, the other one, the female version? Yeah. Uh, her and I met through mutual friends. Okay. Do you have confidence in his best man speech? Is he good at? Yeah, he knows his Are you gonna make people laugh? Are you gonna make people cry? Or are you gonna do both? Hopefully both. Yeah, that's the attitude. <laughs> Hell yeah. You gotta say something like, and when my dog broke its leg, you were there, or whatever. <laughs> Do you have any like sentimental stories with your dude? <laughs> or is this the time where you're gonna be like, and I've always loved you, and I can love you better than we're friends. <laughs> <laughs> That's so disrespectful to call it like, and her friend is just standing up there with you. <laughs> cool. What did she say? No, the conversation's here. <laughs> Listen, if you guys talk, I got nothing to do. <laughs> have you ever caught a bank robber? God. You ever have one? Not oh. three times. Knock on wood. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No one robes anyone in New Zealand. <laughs> What's yours is yours, and what have you? <laughs> what a fucking gorgeous, beautiful place where no one wants anyone else's shit. <laughs> you got a beautiful car, mate. I really want that. I'm feeling pretty envious. I think I'll just work harder until I get it. <laughs> What's your favorite band? You like the Mars Volta or some shit like that? <laughs> you look like the most Mars Volta fan that you can... <laughs> I really like the Ramones. The Ramones? Yeah. What year is it right now, do you think? <laughs> <laughs> That's not really a 2018 thing to say. That's cool, you work at a record store? Where do you work? Yeah, I... Oh, you're from Vegas, you're the Vegas guys. No, he's the Vegas guy. You're the Vegas guy, you're like, don't, don't group me. <laughs> uh, where do you work? Uh, down in San Diego. You just, you just run around the city. I'll take it from here. What are you doing? What are you doing? You painting that fire hydrant? Well, I work in San Diego. So what you <laughs> Makes, what's the shittiest thing about you guys? Oh, and for each other. You <laughs> No, no, no. This won't, you won't break up because of this. Uh, you, what is the shittiest thing about him? I can tell you for him. What? Because you know it, you just don't know if it's going to end your relationship. I don't want to risk it. 
Would it be easier if you answered for each other, or do you have something in the oh. you in the barrel? What? Oh, trap, 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 trap. Yeah. Say, no, you have to go first. Yeah, ladies first, please. I hate when he. <laughs> I hate when he tells me what to do. When he tells you what to do, okay? Yeah. All right. <laughs> you guys are gonna break up before the end. <laughs> like what? As far as like, uh, like eating and stuff. Um. Like where you want to eat. No, like we'll, we'll get we'll get out of the car and he's parked like too close next to someone on like the passenger side, so I'll start opening the door. And he's like, "Don't hit that person." Like, yeah, I'm not stupid. Dude, <laughs> yo, you're me. <laughs> I do that shit. I do that shit, and I'm sorry for him. Asshole. <laughs> what? Asshole. <laughs> you're a piece of shit, and I'm an asshole. We're gonna be together forever. Good, good shit. And now, what if I didn't let you go? What if I just let you go? That's a one-way fight on the way home. Oh, I'm an asshole, hi, tell you what to do. What's your favorite band? Do you have a favorite band? What? Why is that for me? Why do you work for it? What's your favorite band? Big Fallers. Big Fallers? Nice, big fan as well. Some say I look like Dave Grohl. <laughs> He's rich, so like, <laughs> if it were me, just a thinner me, surrounded by money, I'm sure you take care of it. <laughs> I look like Dave Grohl until you get the banking, the bank account, and, uh, and the talent. <laughs> I still have the talent as well. He was in the. Nirvana. Do you remember <laughs> the Nirvanas in the 90s? <laughs> that sad lady, Kurt Cobain, was the lead singer. <laughs> Lithium and what have ya. <laughs> Don't judge a book by its cover, you know? Yeah, no, but I love, I love all that stuff. You I love old motorcycles. Classic cars and bikes, yeah. Yeah, that's cool. You know what kind of show got me into old motorcycles? American Pickers. Yeah. You guys yeah, watch American awesome. Pickers? Hell yeah. Welcome to uh, Talking American Pickers. <laughs> yeah. That's where we wait and see what they pick up from a hoarder who's about to die, and then we'll see how much it's worth, and then we come here and we talk about it. Everyone on that show they buy from is about to die. Yeah. <laughs> and they all have the same very sad story. They're like, well, <laughs> they're looking at like barns filled with shit. You see the show? Yes, yeah. And they're like, well, we just can't. <laughs> we just can't have it anymore. So. And then Mike and the other guy is like, yeah, we got this list. If you got old signs, new signs. My family could afford back in the 20s. <laughs> but my grandson says I can't have it anymore. So <laughs> and then they do the thing where they're like, well, I don't know, make me an offer. And then Mike's like, why can't you both jobs? <laughs> you make me an offer, and then we have it. That's how this thing goes. <laughs> and she's like, well. How do you put a price on your only toy for years? <laughs> and then what's the next thing he says? Well, it's Mr. Wheel! <laughs> How can it possibly be that budget, Mr. Wheel? You could work in a, like, Amoeba Music. You could work there. Right? I'm going by looks alone. That's not how you're supposed to do things nowadays. <laughs> what's your favorite band, Dustin? Uh, I like soundtracks. You like soundtracks to movies. The worst band they ever. <laughs> Who are you going to see tonight? Well, the Ramones are playing with soundtracks to movies, and I don't know what year it is. <laughs> Dude, what, a, what an eclectic group. She's like Josh Groban, the speeding home from the mall, Josh Groban. And you're like, oh, the Amy soundtrack. You're like, look at it! I got seven CDs in the changer. It's <laughs> Jurassic Park slowed down. 
Airbud 3? Annie? <laughs> Does she ever let you play you drive around a lot together? Yeah. Does she let you do the Spotify sometimes? Ah. What do you put in the, what do you like? Okay, you just assume I won't know Mexican music. <laughs> well, I'll show her. Why don't you go ahead and name a Mexican band that you like? Please say Selena, please say Selena. Please say Selena, you will speak. No. Selena, here in my room. Thank you, thank you. That will about do it for, for you and I. <laughs> as far as me being on top of my shit goes, looks like we're all set. <laughs> also, also, before you answer, yes. everyone's looking at you. <laughs> I got that, but it's not them that's making me nervous. Sure. It's what's gonna happen later. It's the, it's the aerial system. Exactly. Uh... <laughs> I should have made you guys uh, do this. Uh, uh, answer me. <laughs> I don't like when she. Mm, I. Uh, no, you know what? I'm not gonna make it. I know making it hard. But it's just I don't. I just, uh, baby, I love you so very. Oh, no. <laughs> you guys in the back. If anyone was like, I wish there was a table up front. Give it like five minutes. <laughs> What did it say? Oh, fuck. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I, I... How do I make you angry? Oh. Keep in mind, keep in mind you've already waited too long <laughs> for it to be okay. <laughs> uh, 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 I, 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 I wish... You guys, I fucked up. But what makes me angry is... You're con you're constant forgetting of very important things. Hey everybody, welcome to the show! <laughs>